Yes, this is our new activity. Read and number the parts of the address. You see that there is a postcard here. Let's read together. July 17th. Dear Wendy, London is really fun. Yesterday, we saw a big dinosaur skeletons at the Museum of Natural History. I want to see Buckingham Palace tomorrow. The Queen lives there. Wish you were here. Love, Gina. Okay. Let's look at this vocabulary. What is the meaning of city? Like Istanbul. Istanbul is a city. What's the meaning of country? Yes, you are right. Like Turkey. Turkey is a country. Name. Of course, Ali Ayşe is a name. Postal code. When you want to send a card, you have to write this code on your letter. Mm -hmm. And what is state territory? Yes, this is a land which is controlled by a particular country. For example, Russia, Russian territory, like that. And street, you know the meaning of street, I think. Okay, let's put these numbers here. Okay, city. Which one is city? Did you find? Yes, you are right. Of course, Los Angeles is a city. Let's continue with the country. Which one is country? Yes, you are right. USA is a country. Let's continue with the name. Hmm. Yes, of course, it is easy. Wendy is a name. And what about postal code? Yes, 9001 is a postal code. Okay. Now, state or territory? Yes, California. And last one, street? Main street, of course. Okay, well done, good job. Yes, yeah, second part. Please write a postcard to a friend. Your homework is this. You are going to answer these questions. First of all, which place would you most like to visit? Mm -hmm. Draw a picture of this place on the front of your postcard. On the back, write to your friend. Imagine you are a tourist there. What place are you visiting? What did you do yesterday? What do you want to do next? And don't forget to write your friend's name and address. Okay? I hope you can do your homework very well. See you later. Okay. Let's sing a song, but first of all, we have to look these travel nouns and travel verbs together. Repeat after me, please. Airport, camera, hotel, passport, bus station, train station, suitcase, ticket, vacation. Now, travel verbs. Bring, pack, take a vacation, take a bus, take a plane, take a train. Okay, let's continue. Now, let's listen the song together. Okay, now let's do the second activity. Look and answer the questions for each picture. First one. Are they at an airport, a bus station or someone else? Yes, we are right. They are at an airport. You see that? There is a plane. Okay. Second question. Are they traveling by train, plane, 
tree or a car? Yes, they are traveling by plane here. Mm -hmm. And last one. Do you think they need tickets? Why or why not? Do you think they need tickets? Yes, of course, they need tickets for plane because they leave the country. Very good. That's all. See you. Other less. Let's continue with the third activity. Read and choose the correct options. Okay, first one. You can pack the things you need in a... Yes, you are right. Suitcase, of course. Mm -hmm. Second one. You need to have your to leave the country. Hmm, what we need? Of course, a passport. Your passport. Mm -hmm. Third one. You can get on a plane at the... Hmm, where? Of course, an airport. Very good. Number four. You are boarding a plane. Do you have your... Hmm, what? Of course, tickets. And last one, when you travel, you can sleep in a, here it is written, room. Yes, of course, in a hotel room. That's all. We finished. See you. Let's study this grammar part together. Going to for future plans. Be going to plus verb. Expresses plans for the future. Let's look at some sentences. Positive sentence. I am going to ride a train in the future. He is going to ride a train or she is going to ride a train. Or you are going to ride a train. We are going to ride a train. Negative sentence now. I am not going to ride a train. He isn't going to ride a train. You aren't going to ride a train. Or they aren't going to ride a train. When you want to make a question, am I going to stay in a hotel? Yes, I am. No, I am not. Is she going to stay in a hotel? Yes, she is. Is he going to stay in a hotel? No, he isn't. Or are you going to stay in a hotel? Yes, you are. Are we going to stay in a hotel? Yes, we are. Are they going to stay in a hotel? No, they aren't. Like that. And a question, general question. What are you going to do this summer? This question asks you about your future plan. What are you going to do this summer? I am going to visit my friend this summer. Or, I am going to travel with my family this summer. These are my plans. Okay, let's continue. Yes, a reading activity now. Read and underline the plans with going to. What are you going to do this summer? Let's read. Zoo. I am going to visit natural Air and Space Museum in Washington, D.C. in the USA. They have a lot of planes and spacecraft. I am going to touch a rock from the moon. Okay, let's read Ashley's. My family is going to ride the chocolate train in Switzerland. We have our train tickets already. It goes up a mountain and stops at a chocolate factory. And Matteo. We are going to go to Siancan. It's a resort in Mexico. It's not far, so we are not going to fly there. We can take our car. We are going to stay right on the beach. Okay. Yes, we read the paragraph. I want to ask a question. What is Zoo going to do in this summer? What's her plan? Yes, she said that I am going to visit the natural, National Air and Space Museum. National Air and Space Museum. Very good. What about Ashley? Her plan? Yes, she said that my family is going to ride the chocolate train in Switzerland. Very good. 
And what about Matsuro? He said that mm -hmm, they are going to go to Sianca. It's a reserve in Mexico. Yes, we learn their plans. Now let's answer the question with the other activity. Yes, second activity. Unscribble the questions. Okay, and then read and write the answers. First one. Please do it by yourself. Mm -hmm. Yes, you are right. Let's see the answer. Is you going to see a spacecraft? The answer is, of course, yes, she is. Very good. Second one, please do it. Yes, you are right. Is Ashley going to ride up the mountain on a bus? Mm -hmm. The answer is, no, she isn't. You are right. Very good. What about Matteo? Do it, please. Yes, you are right. Are Matteo and his family going to stay on the beach? Yes, they are. Very good. And what about you? I want to give you a homework. Your homework is you are going to write a paragraph in your notebook. What are we going to do this summer? Your plans. Okay? Please write at least five sentences in your notebook. See you.